Hello guys, what's up? Alright, so tonight I am making a video kind of, um, I don't really know, like, there's really no category for it. It's kind of just like everything video, like an opinion video. Mm. Sorry, um, it's kind of like an opinion video, an education video, all at once. It's kind of just, it's another one of my random videos. <laughs> But, um, tonight I'm going to talk about LGBT, sorry, I have trouble pronouncing that, LGBT, bleh, LGBT, um, and most people know what that means, but if you don't, um, LGBT stands for lesbian, gay, bi, and, wait, L yeah, lesbian, gay, bi, and transgender, so those are the four, um, that's in that term, but, it also leaves out some stuff too. Uh, there's asexual, there's pansexual, and well, there's a couple, there's a few more too, but the term leaves out some stuff. So, um, so this is just a video about the LGBT community and just some, you know, some stuff that I want to talk about. <clears throat> okay, so for one, I'm all for, you know, gay rights. Um, I'm, you know, um, in California, where I live, um, we do have the legal right to, um, for of gay marriage. Uh, it didn't start out that way. We, it was actually illegal at first because of Prop 8. Um, Prop 8 outlawed gay marriage here in California. And, um, a lot of people voted yes on it and it passed. Um, and then I guess back when I was in high school, I don't remember the exact year, but when I was in high school, it changed and uh, it became unconstitutional. So we do have the legal right here to marry if you're uh, gay. Um, but um, <clears throat> yeah, some states still uh, don't have that. Uh, st it's still illegal in some places. Um, new states are coming out every day, making it unconstitutional. So it's it's getting closer to being all fifty states, but it's not all fifty yet. But it's it's definitely getting closer. There's you know, states every day that are coming out and making it unconstitutional, so that's good. Um, you know, my opinion is pretty much the same opinion as everybody who's, you know, f you know, has no problem with gay people. My opinion is basically the same, you know, love is love, gender doesn't, you know, like, you can't control who you love, you know, you can't help who you love, like, like, if you love a girl, like, if you're a girl and you love a girl, you know, power to you, it's, you know, it's you, you're, that's who you are, don't, you know, don't, knock it like that that's just who you are you like girls that doesn't make you a different person same if you're a guy and you like get men it just doesn't you know it, it doesn't make you a bad person it doesn't make you any different you're still you it's just who you love um and um um Sorry, I keep hearing footsteps outside my door. It's kind of weird. Okay, um, so... <clears throat> okay, so... Being gay is not something that you're born with. Um, it's kind of... It's not really... It's something that you kind of just discover as you get older. Um, that's kind of what I've figured out. Um, it's not really... You know, I've always wondered to myself, like, do you just born that way, or is it a learned behavior? And what I've learned is it's just something that you just figure out. Like, you just grow up, you have crushes, you experiment, and you find out what you're into and what you're not into. And so, yeah, for those of you who are afraid to come out, um, I'd say don't be. There's got to be somebody in your life that you can trust. Uh, start with them, come out to them first, and, yeah, um, if, you know, if they don't, <clears throat> if they don't accept you, then they're not your friends. <laughs> you don't need people like that in your life. You need people who will trust you and who will always be there for you, no matter what. Um, so just a couple educational stuff, um. Gender and sex are two different things. Um, <clears throat> I may have this wrong, so correct me if I'm wrong, but I think sex is what you're born with, like your genitals. 
and gender is what you identify yourself as which is where the term transgender comes in like you could be born with female genitals but feel like a male or vice versa so your gender is what you determine yourself as like okay like you can be a you can physically be a boy but you can call yourself a girl because that's what you feel inside you feel like you're a girl and that's just what you feel inside so that's why the term transgender came instead of transsexual transsexual is people who actually get the operation and become the opposite sex whereas transgender is somebody who hasn't actually gone through the operation yet but has has <clears throat> identified themselves as the opposite gender um most people know that, I don't know, um, some people probably don't, so if you don't, that's... Um, then there's pansexual, which I guess my friend explained to me, it's where you can see yourself with anybody. You can see yourself with a girl, you can see yourself with a guy, you can see yourself with a transgendered person, you can see yourself with everybody. And I'm so confused, I'm not sure exactly, like to me pansexual and bisexual kind of seem like the same thing to me, but I gotta study into that some more. I'm not really quite sure how that works. It seems like it would be the same thing, but uh, it's, I guess pansexual and bisexual are different. So uh, you, if you want to explain to me in the comments and help me understand, that'd be great, because I'm still not quite sure about like the difference between the two, so it'd be great. Um, yeah, so that's it. Um, I just wanted to give you a little bit of the education that I know. I'm still learning more about it myself, so I'm not the expert by any means. But I just, you know, I'm just sharing what I know. And, yeah, and just my advice for those of you who are afraid to come out. Um, yeah, I understand how hard it can be. Because you're afraid, you know, everyone's going to judge you and whatnot, but... Just know that there's always going to be that one person in your life that won't judge you. And you know who that person is. And so that, start with that person. And whoever does judge you isn't your friend. And you don't need negative people like that in your life. So, yeah. Um, just embrace it. Don't, don't be ashamed of who you are. So, yeah. Alright, guys. Bye.